Let's see where hi, this goes. Oh, hi. It might be a little beyond my job description to ask, but at my heart, I'm still a bellhop. Was the suite to your liking? Uh, yeah, it's actually pretty nice, except, of course, one of the rooms was absolutely obliterated. Uh, it was fine. I don't feel too strongly about it, though. That's completely fine, Inspector. Hopefully you'll warm up to it. Now, I'd Me too. love to bring you to a floor of your choosing. Um, I'd like to visit the VIP room. authorized to visit that floor why what authorized floor can I bring you to okay well rude I guess the lobby I don't have much of an option do I to the lobby we go and I'll be taking absolutely no but wait did I did I bring somebody with me I think I might have brought companions with me so I brought Felix and Vicar Max okay that's fine that works uh so we're Oh yeah, of course. I should have just left the building. That's what I really should have done, but I guess I didn't think about it all the way through. Oh well. Spectrum Vodka. So let me see, where on the map is this exactly? I really hate how it gets blurry. So it's actually a pretty big area, it appears. I'm excited though that I get to go to another area. Excuse me, coming through. Let me see here. Oh, you you people scared me. We're in the middle of a lockdown. No one's supposed to be coming or going. And when I can't get a hold of anyone in the orchards, I can't make <coughs> sure of that, can I? No, Miss Vargas. Sorry, I'll work on getting a hold of someone. Great, you do that. I'll be waiting right here. Cool. She's named, so I'm gonna talk to her. Swear to the architect, Matthias. If you've lost your rifle's ionization coil again. Oh, wait. You ain't part of my crew. What do you want? I'm not a part of your crew. And I actually have a couple of questions for you. Who's Matthias? An idiot. <laughs> I suspect he's avoiding me, actually, which is the first smart thing he's done all month. <laughs> Sorry, but do you need something? Between the landing pad, lockdowns, gate closures, and constant questions from angry guests, I've got a lot on my plate. And if that don't beat all, one of my crew is AWOL. Uh, a missing person? I'm actually an inspector. I could look into it for you if you want. If you're serious, I'd appreciate <clears throat> the help. He's been missing a few days, and we're low on staff as it is. Uh, a few days? Why'd you wait uh, until now to look for him? It's not exactly uncommon for slug agents to go on the odd bender. They'll pick a place they think I don't know about and hunker down. Usually I don't bother with the discipline and paperwork. Gotta pick your battles. Thing is, they usually resurface within 24 hours. Or at least yell for medical help. This guy, not a peep. Interesting. Yeah, I'll look, in f I'll, I'll look into it. I'll let you know what I find. The missing crew member's Evan O'Connell. He's one of about two <coughs> slug agents I can trust with more complex tasks than stand here and look tough. Friendly type. Well behaved, followed orders. Anyone else, I'd think they got drunk and fell asleep in a ditch somewhere, but O'Connell's not really the type. He was last stationed at the Wilderness Checkpoint. I'd search there first. Cool. Thank you. The Wilderness Checkpoint? I'm curious to know where that's at. That's this one, right? Uh, no. Oh, wait. I don't know. <clears throat> so we'll stay, we'll stay on the, wait, hold on. Side quest, this is the one. So let's see where this is. That's actually right behind us should we do that first let's let's go do that first actually i'm i'm curious to find out what this is all about you never know maybe it's something important or maybe it'll tie into the main investigation oh god what is this 
I got you, I got you. Let's go. Oh my god, this dude did it. Oh, that's awesome. Where are they at? You. Okay, who else? Who else do we got? Oh, you. Where'd you come from? Pretty sure he just juked me. Rude. This weapon sounds cool. Regardless of man's feeble attempts at control. Can I can't even get in there? How am I supposed to get in there? There's gotta be a key. Maybe on the roof? Oh. No key, but definitely a way to get in. Examine. Wilderness checkpoint note. Evan, remember, cards tonight. If you don't show, I'll set a raptor down loose. That's awfully convenient, seeing as there was a bunch of uh, raptorons outside uh, in here with you in it. I'm kidding. But don't forget, uh, you hear, I need help knocking Bea? Bay? B Bea? I can't, I don't know who, I don't know how to pronounce that word. Uh, down a rug or three. She had me writing field reports for her all week. Botanical operations building cards tonight. Fits. Okay. I need a key to get out of here, don't I? Um. How do I get out of here? Did I assault rifle? But there's a bunch of normal stuff, but no key. And I think I need a key to get out. Otherwise, I'm stuck. Let's go ahead and break that down. How's there no keys? What am I missing? There's got to be a key around here somewhere. Vicar, get out of my way, bro. I need to search for a key. Bro, I think I'm stuck. Well, I guess we'll take that for now and we'll tear it down. Whoops. I put it into junk. Oh, well. Dude, seriously though? How do, you, how do I get out of here? I'm so confused right now. Cause I can't, I can't pick it. Wait, does this do anything? Oh, I feel dumb. Well, the good thing is I can always, oh wait, I forgot. This is my dumb character. I can't sell that. I haven't unlocked the skill to be able to sell it. So Evan's trail. Maybe he's, maybe he's there playing cards by himself. You never know. You just never know. It's in this building. Hello, anyone here? I'll go down there in a second. Let me search real quick for things. Nothing too important, just a bunch of normal loot, but it's okay. We'll go downstairs now and find out where Evan is. Who are you? Slug Bruiser? That's a typical NPC, isn't it? Uh, I'm not gonna loot that with that person just standing there. The Dissident Queen Chapter 3? I'm not gonna read that. I'm not a very good reader if you haven't noticed already, so... Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Timeline discrepancy. Okay. So there's something going on. Wait, hold on. Let's click on this. <clears throat> Work assignment. A slug employee uh, schedule. Under Crew C, Purpleberry Orchards, and Connector Complex, someone has scratched out a name and replaced it with Evan O'Connell. Huh. Okay, well, there's got to be a clue in here because my, my thing said something. Where could it be, though? 
Can I talk to this person? We don't talk troublemakers. No. Hello. I legit don't see anything. That appears to be an exit. Slug storeroom key. I wonder where that's where that is. The lady outside probably has it. To ground colonial hotel. I'm tempted to go in there. Just just quickly. I just want to see what's in here. You never know. Maybe it's something pretty important. This is marked as red. I think I'm trespassing. Wait, hold on. Oh yeah, that's upstairs. If I if if this is the trespassing situation. Something mighty strange went on earlier. What happened? Norval get his cap stuck in the toilet again? Not today. I was carrying a bag up to the second VIP guest floor earlier. Even for our guests, it was spectacularly heavy. Oh my god. Wow, exciting. Okay, well, whatever. He's just being lazy, complaining about his job. I'm not gonna do him any favors or listen to him. What's in here? That legitimately looks important. Those look like the cases where the science weapons were. I can't even go through there either, though. These are the moments that I wish there was like a... Like in Fallout, you have your pit boy light? Don't give their workers a decent living. Why would they? That be... Uh-oh. Okay, so let's go with this. No. Decent. Here they come! Die! Nobody messes with you, boss! Thank you? But you're right. What's going on? You! Come here! Where are these little guys at? Oh, there's one right here. Off with your head! Nobody? Yeah, that's what I thought. This hammer is so cool. I like this hammer a lot, actually. Ooh, pistol. It's a Mark III. No, thank you, but thank you for asking. Oh, that one's not a bad guy. I'm not gonna kill him. C3. I'm definitely trespassing in someone's room. <gasps> Heads up! Ah! <laughs> this definitely reminds me of New Vegas. Oh my god. This guy's beefy. Okay, you're getting a power hit. This guy is super beefy. Oh god. There we go, it's about time they're helping. Why is this guy so beefy? That's it. <laughs> Vickers about to, fall, uh, to die too. <laughs> That's hilarious, dude. They just stay falling. Okay, let's see what this guy has. Spread hide, okay, some rings. Uh, nothing nothing important hotel guest we got a dead hotel guest here that's dangerous ooh is this a legendary or a unique I mean no but I finally got that cool freaking outfit 56 armor I think I'm gonna wear this I kind of like it, to be honest. What is this? Engineer's fighter note. I don't, don't want to read that. I don't think it's very... I don't think it's pertinent to... To what I'm doing. As far as this side quest. Or the main quest, for that matter. Alright, there's more enemies, it looks like, to the right over there. But I kind of want to see you over here. Nah, there's nothing over here. So let's go off the rest of these bad guys. These little bad little rats. If I could even find them, I don't even know where they're at. What in the world is this? 
What is this? It's marked as an enemy. Score one for Felix. Parasite spawning? Thunderclap, that's gotta be a unique. It is. Sick, dude. You know who would love that? Uh, Parvati would love that. She has Maxwell, though, but... Oh, no, and although I do like her having Maxwell because she does like, uh, like, cereals and stuff like that, so... Who knows? Maybe she'll keep it, but if this is stronger... Who knows? Maybe I'll let her have a new weapon. Got some more stuff here. Some more Halcyon Helen stuff. I can't see a thing in here. Are these fake? Pile of cartridges uh, contains the IDs of Halcyon Helen's sidekicks who were killed. So that's all serial stuff. Nothing in there. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what what else would be down here. You uh, hear about the murder? How the hell could I not have heard about it? We couldn't even leave our rooms earlier while security. So that's these two ag again. Get it. What's the point of being down here besides getting the legendary? I don't see a thing. We're in the kitchen area now. Don't need ammo or anything like that, so there's no point of picking any of that up. So I'm just not. Hey, wait, there's a note right here. Out of order notice? Yes, of course. Why not? Why not? I was. Huh. Okay, well, let's get out of here then. There's definitely nothing in there, so there's no point of being in there. Strange, indeed. I still want to know how to get in here. Slug storeroom key. I'm pretty sure in order to get it, though, I have to pickpocket someone or or something. I don't know. Can I tinker this a little bit more? It's level 28. That's level 30. It's expensive, though. No, I can't even afford it, even if I wanted to. I'm pretty sure I already searched all of this. Discrepancy detected nearby. Yeah, see, this is... There's something. Oh, right here. Analysis concludes. The losing player used an overly cautious strategy that led to an insurmountable deficit in points. Got it. So he was losing. Slug discipline records show a half dozen reports of illegal gambling in games of chance on company property. Perhaps there's evidence of an ante for this game? Uh. Discouraging gambling? Maybe Slug is serious about uh, being on the up and up. On the Groundbreaker, dock workers used to bet their shifts on a game of cards. Maybe they're doing something like that. Got it. So we got a clue. A pretty big one, too. There was some gambling involved, apparently. Which is never really a good thing when there's gambling involved, you know? People end up... Owing other people money, and then it just gets worse and worse. Hold on, this is kind of far. Where's it at on the map? Oh, God. Oh, so now we're going in the direction we were supposed to go. Very nice. Hopefully, there's a lot of good stuff over there. I am curious, though, to find out how that hammer that I picked up over there... What is it called? It Again, Thunderstruck or something? Thunderclap. Not for quiet assassins, consider wearing earplugs. I don't know, I'm, I'm very curious to see how that stacks up to Maxwell. Hey! Like a dead rat. Hey, what's up, man? Oh, you're that inspector, right. Uh, sorry, but the pool's currently closed on account of it stinking worse than my boss. <laughs> <laughs> what can I do for you? Uh, let me see. Why does the... Why does the pool look all 
green and stuff. Space me if I knew. I got here from my shift this morning and found it this way. They can't yell at me for this one, which is good, because a lot of folks seem upset by it. Why are people upset? Part of the reception for the Spectrum Brown launch was supposed to be out here. Rizzo's rented out the area, said they had their own maintenance person instead of paying one of slugs. As you can see, their maintenance person ruined the use of the pool for everyone. Would have been even worse if the unveiling hadn't been cancelled. Can't do much now but wait for the stench to wear off. We found the individual hired to clean face down in a puddle of his own spit in the orchards. Guess he won't be helping. Yeah, it makes sense. Face down in his own spit? Look, I call it how I see it. They found the poor slackwit alongside syringes enough to put down a herd of mantasaurs. Damn. His family will have to be fine. Rizzo should have been more careful about who they hired. They're lucky nothing got permanently damaged. That still sucks, though. Something about this uh, sounds off kilter. I'd like to take a look around, please. Uh, all right. You may want to visit the sun parlor. That's where that Rizzo's fool mixed the chemicals he used. Oh, and you can talk to Lily, my boss. She probably has some great advice. I saw her walk toward the bridge to the Purpleberry Orchards earlier. Reckon she's still there. Now, uh, anything else I can do for you? Uh, well, can you answer some questions about the pool for me? So long as you don't want to go in, I can answer anything you like. Uh, pretty heavily armed for a pool guard, aren't you? Uh, yeah, it's part of the job. I think I'm listed as a security consultant. But all that really means is that if I'm caught without this thing, I get put on pool guard duty. I don't know what happens if I'm caught without it on pool guard duty, but I know that I don't want to find out. You said, uh, that Rizzo's hired, uh, someone to do the cleaning? Yep, still dead. <laughs> Usually Rizzo's is pretty good at making sure the people they hire ain't got tripacale for brains. But that fella clearly wasn't worth trusting. I met him briefly once. Seemed level-headed enough, but that must have been just a front. Otherwise, he wouldn't have made such a mess of things. Got it. Well, that's everything for now. Thank you, man. Sounds good to me. I am curious about all of this, though. This pool looks absolutely disgusting. It's green, dude. I don't know if that's like... Uh, like vegetation, knockout court. fungal. It's pretty much just toss ball for folks who don't want to get their hands dirty. Okay, good to know. Ah, back to square one. We're back to where we started, or at least got that last uh, side quest. I do want to look in here though. I'm not gonna take anything. Improved hunter kit. Man, I wish my main character had this. I didn't even know that was a thing. It might be added on the DLC, to be honest. Long guns plus five? Yeah, that's definitely something. Oh, I don't like... I don't like the sound of this at all. Like, at all. I'm scared of heights and, uh... Oh, God. That's a long way down. Very long way down. Let's try to avoid the edges. Before we end up falling in, you know, to our death. Although I do kind of want to do it just for fun. See what happens when you jump off. OMG. Okay. Well, did I just, yeah, I, I chose the wrong thing again. Alright, let's check up here first because I don't want to go down there quite yet. Although there's something up here. I, I can hear a cane. There he is. I'm coming. What's up, buddy? Yeah, you're right, Felix. That is what he gets. Is there another one? That sounds like a raptodon. Where is he? It's a freaking marauder. I don't see the last. I don't see these guys. I'm coming. Got him. There's still more, dude. How many are there? Got him. That's the last of him. 
Wow. Okay, yeah, that was a lot. I'll be taking that, though. Thank you very much. Plasma Rifle 3.0. Plasma Rifles are pretty damn good, man. Can I tinker up yet? Uh, no. It's gonna be a while before I can tinker up, man, because this weapon... Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Good to know. You know it's already- you know it's here. The garb on this security guard identifies him as a member of the Rizzo's corporation. You don't His say. would have been that of jawbreaker or higher. This security guard has experienced premature expiration. Evidence strongly suggests a conflict with marauders. Uh, there's a- There's like Adrena time next to him, so... Yeah, let's check his pockets. Gain purple berry crunch? I didn't mean to to steal or loot from the body. I was I, I meant search his pockets for like something investigative, but let's pay our respects. Death removes that which we worked so hard to create in life, a shell to protect us from pain. But it is this shell, this self, that is the cause of all our suffering. He is now free. That was, that was a very thoughtful thing to say. He is a vicar, though, so... It doesn't really surprise me, to be honest, that he spoke like that, but... Dude, he did not... Unless this was all for him from the Marauders, but it kind of looks like he committed, like... He did, like, overdose or something. I don't know. I just don't know. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Timeline discrepancy. Well, there's something right there, and I want to get it. Machine Gun Mark III? What does Felix have? He has a machine gun of some sort. Uh, uh, so he already has a Mark III. But is this a level 31? It is. So it's literally the same thing. Let's go ahead and just trash that. Let's listen to this. Hey, Chris It's me. Evan must have gotten into the spectrum in these crates. Listen to this. Come out! Come out to play! <laughs> He's having a grand old time. I'm gonna take him to A2 under the hotel so he can sleep it off. I'll meet you back at the orchard straight after. See you soon. Evan, come on, you slackwit. Okay. It doesn't appear like there's anything else. Is there, like, a way to get on the roof or anything? Not that I see. So I guess, uh, I guess the only way is back. Hold up. Is there a way down over here? There is. Huh. It's another dead body. This guy has a bolter pistol though. Oh, I'm not. I'm getting... I feel... I feel gross when I get close to that. The edge of that. I'm telling you, dude, I don't like heights. Okay, well, let's get out of here. There's nothing down here. It doesn't At least it doesn't look like there is. So let's go all the way back because apparently we have to go. Let's check out the map and see how far we got to go. Okay, so it's back to uh, the pool plaza. We were literally just there when we got the quest for uh, the pool plaza. For the, for the pool, I don't even know what it's called. Luckily, it's not very far. This world, or if you want to call it a world, like this area, it's uh, it's really freaking cool, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Also, it's not actually in the pool area. It's we have to go inside. And now that I think about it, we never actually looked in here. Like, actually explored. We might do that a little bit. Although there really isn't much to explore, is there? There's a bar. Oh god, that scared me. Not gonna lie. That freaking robot farted, though. Nah, there's nothing in here. I wonder if I could go back there. 
Why, yes I can. Nothing to investigate though, that's interesting. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. I spoke too soon. Wait, I just saw it. It's right here somewhere. There we go. An Analyze. Industrial grade laxative has been added to the liquor in these bottles. Whoa. Well, that's an interesting piece of development. What's this thing? Rizzo's Rangers Tosser Uniform. Let's see if this is unique. Doesn't sound like it, though. Oh, it is! That looks cool. So what does this do? Uh, plus 10 to dodge. Dodge plus 10, movement penalty to accuracy minus 15%. Weapon AOE radius, 20%. I really feel like Felix would like that. I think I want to keep this though. What is this thing? Severed head of Burge, uh, Bur Badge 2000? Okay. I think we're I think we're done here. I can't get I can't go in there. Looks like there's a, a back way to get there. Okay, I don't know. There's a whole lot of nothing though in these rooms, isn't there? I don't want to do this. I want to go down there. Okay, I just I'm getting distracted. You need to stop being rude, sir. How do I get down there? Is there? Oh, there we go. Stairs. I was literally about to ask if there were stairs. Is that Chef Raymond? No, this is Chef Anwar. Terribly sorry, but I can't chat just now. Someone on the second VIP level just ordered 15 canid meat pies, and if I don't get to it now, it'll be my head. He looks like Chef Raymond. I'm an inspector. I have some questions to ask you about Halcyon Helen's murder. I understand your devotion to your job. Really, I do. And I hope you'll understand mine. Things might change if you had something very particular to talk to me about, but I'm afraid I'm just too busy to talk right now. I'd be delighted to chat with you later. Uh, I suppose that's fair? I wish I, w I had an option to press him a little bit. Oh, so we're on the other side now. So let's not go this way, because we clearly have to go over here. Ooh, wait, out of order. Broken elevator notice. Mighty convenient, don't you say? Okay, it looks like there might be something down here, so... Is this guy... No, this is just a normal bellhop. Nothing interesting down here? Nope. I guess instead of cleaning or picking up the stuff... Wait a minute. Uh... Okay, so that was interesting. We've been here before. Hold on, I, I gotta remember how to get over there. It's over, it's, yeah, it's over here. Yeah, this is where we got that one legendary hammer. So how do I get this? Give it to me. Inspector, I've detected a structural anomaly within a... Point eight meter radius of this locked door. Uh, does the door have a weak point? The structural anomaly is not present in the design of the door. Please direct your attention to this nearby floor panel. This floor panel is 0 0.3 millimeters shorter than regulation length, suggesting unauthorized modification. Okay, that's interesting. I'll definitely keep that in mind, man. Thank you. Floorboard. Click. Underneath, uh, the loose floor panel is a slightly dirty key card for room A2. Take key? Absolutely, dude. Here they come. Coming. Ah! Get it off! Get it off! Get oh my god, this thing is in Where'd he go? Um... 
I have no idea where he went. But I'm just gonna follow Felix here. Or maybe not. I legit have no idea where he went. Oh, oh okay. I, I mean, I don't know what to say. He's gone. No, this is the room... We were at before. Ah, here it is. Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Timeline discrepancy it is. Analysis confirms this is Evan O'Connell. Analysis also confirms he is dead. I should have known that he was going to be dead. He's been missing and stuff. And knowing how things go in Halcyon, it's clear that he was dead, but... Dying by that worm thing is kind of messed up. Let me see, uh, what's the cause of death? Per additional study of this body's skeletal structure, the cause of death was head trauma. Head trauma? Are you telling me this wasn't, uh, he wasn't killed by a giant murder slug? That is correct. Evan was not killed by a Rodanium gigaseus. However, Eridanium gigaseus do appear to be responsible for the early decomposition of this body's surface tissue. <laughs> so, what did kill him then? Further analysis indicates Evan's fatal injuries were sustained from blunt force trauma to the back of the skull, and his head collided with the ground. So, a hammer. Let's check it and see if there was any foul play. There are traces of blood on Evan's hands, Inspector. Interesting. Sounds like Evan might have been doing a little brawling. Analysis concludes. This blood is human. Type A. Medical records indicate Evan O'Connell's blood is type O. <laughs> this asshole stealing people's blood. It is highly likely the blood <laughs> is the result of an altercation. Got it. I think it's time uh, we talk to Miss Stillwell. If you wish to question Amelia Stillwell, slug scheduling records indicate that she is presently on duty at the pilot house checkpoint. Aw, rest in peace, Evan. You don't deserve... You don't deserve death. At least not the way it happened. Man, I really wanted to find out what was on that freaking thing's body. It might still be around here somewhere, though. Let's do some light investigative. I think it's upstairs, though. Yeah, let's check upstairs. There's gotta be... He's gotta be around here somewhere, dude. If I could even go upstairs. Hey, wait, what's in here? We didn't look in here before. Ooh, a safe that I can't crack. I bet you there's a unique weapon in there. I bet you there is, but I can't access it. All right, let's check over here. Any stairs at all? I don't think so. I don't think I'm gonna be able to go up there. That bug is stuck. Tear. I'm a sad, sad man now. Oh, this is another notice about the elevator. That's great. Let's get out of here. I'm done. I'm done with this place. Hold on. There is something, though. Okay. So, it's over here to the left. And let's go all the way around. What was that? What is he doing? What is this guy scared for? Why is he scared? I don't know. I just don't know. So let's find Miss Stillwell. If I follow this, it'll take me straight there. Hopefully, of course. That is the big question. This looks 
far. There's multiple points on my map. Let me see here. So there's one seemingly around the corner. And one dead ahead. So let's go to the one dead ahead first. They're both relatively close, to be honest. Okay, you know what? That's for that one lady. So this is Little Vargas. That's Stillwell. Let's talk to Little Vargas first before we go over to Miss Stillwell. Just in case. Hope you've been enjoying your stay. Thank you. I I I suppose I have. Maybe I haven't. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Is this a unique? Nope. I wish it was though. So that's just the door that leads outside again. That's still well. Oh, this is where I landed. Got it. You! I need to talk to you. Inspector, you find my missing man? I found uh O'Connell. He's dead. Are you in charge of slug security? Nah, I only manage operations around the hotel. Cedric does most of the maneuvering for Eridanos proper. I don't envy him. The only thing worse than babysitting a couple of hot-headed, overgrown children would be babysitting the entire lot of them. If you hate managing people so much, why didn't you why don't you ask for a transfer? Situation's a little more complicated than you think. Suffice it to say I'm not inclined to question Slug's place for me anytime soon. Hiding something, I see. I feel like our relationship would be more copacetic if you dropped this line of questioning. Or do you just answer my question? Man, I wish I had Intimidate 65. Believe me, it's better for both of us this way. Well, you seem a little different than most slug agents. You mean I can hold a rifle and walk without falling down? <laughs> yeah, I'm different from most slug employees in that way. And only in that way. Anyone who says otherwise should be reported to me personally. Okay, then. Never mind. Great. Anything else? She's not going to answer anything. The pull guard told me uh, to talk to you, uh, said you have some advice. I'm not going to do that yet, because I want to save that for when I'm doing that mission or that quest. So I found O'Connell. He's dead. Shit. That's fucking inconvenient. What happened? Wow, that's all it is? It's just an inconvenience? That's a, that's a person, dude. Uh, just an unfortunate accident. Evan fell and hit his head wrong. That I don't know what the right head. way is, but oh, still. That's embarrassing. If he's gonna die and leave me short-staffed, he ought to at least have the decency to get mauled by raptodons or something. Wow. So Evan was covered in slugs when I found him, though. That's unusual, but I don't see how that factors in. Me either, but I intend to find out. Maybe maybe he tripped on the slug. <laughs> Let's say that. <laughs> Congratulations, Inspector. That is the dumbest thing I've heard all day. <laughs> on the other hand, not like I've got the time to look into it, so sure, he tripped on a slug. Why not? <laughs> Thanks for chasing Evan down and saving me some leg work. Of course, now I gotta figure out who the fuck's replacing Evan. A new day, a new pain in my ass. Okay, so that is a... These people are very, very cold-hearted. Uh, journal. Let's do the other side quest. The pool. Ah, oh, well, we're already here, so let's talk to her about the pool. Oh, sublight underground reputation increased. Let me see if it goes up by anything. No, nope. alright. As much as I'd love to chat, I've got things to do. Well, I should have definitely talked to her when I had the opportunity. Oh well. Too late for that. So let's go. Wait a minute. I didn't even get to talk to the other lady. 
I feel like I probably made a mistake in not talking to Miss Dilwell. I feel like I should have talked to Miss Dilwell. Oh, it's over here. Oh well, if that's the case, that sucks, but it is what it is. Non-slug personnel aren't permitted on the pilot house. Can I help you with something? Uh, I, oh, yeah, I can actually continue on with the investigation. I need to ask you some questions regarding your co-worker, Evan O'Connell. Sure. He in trouble or something? Mm, he's a little more than in trouble. He's dead. You're kidding. Evan's dead? That doesn't... I don't understand. Can, uh... Can I ask what happened? Yeah, he fell and hit his head. Drop the act. You took him to A2. You know damn well what happened. I know he got drunk on the job, and I took him back to the hotel to sleep it off. Left him on one of the beds in A2. He seemed fine. Come on, dude. Hold on. Yeah, I know there's more to this story. Why would you think that? I don't know, maybe that gigantic gash on his head? Because that's how it works in the serials. <laughs> I, wa I want to say the right answer so that I can get uh, the a better ending for this, but hey, I'm, I'm dumb. <laughs> oh, wow, you're serious, aren't you? Yep. I walked Evan to A2, like I said, and then... Out of nowhere, he just came at me. Ah, One she killed him. He's laughing and yelling about sharing his joy. And the next, he's choking the life out of me. Grinned the whole time he was trying to kill me, too. She killed him. So how did you get away? Dumb luck, I guess. I got a good hit in, threw him off, and ran like hell. If I'd known the fault killed him, I... Ah... I should have told someone. Wow. What do you want to know? Wow. She... She kept that a secret, dude. Something so big. Um... Why did you tell anyone that he attacked you? Because Evan would never attack anyone. I barely believe he attacked me and I was there. Guess it shook me up pretty good. Evan's always been a total sweetheart. I don't get it. Adrena time, maybe? So I found slugs on Evan's body. Big ones. Any idea uh, what's that? what that's about? I can't help you there. If Evan was a victim at uh, in this, we owe it to him to find out exactly what happened. Have you been to Purpleberry Orchards, Inspector? Not yet. Awfully nice out there. You should visit. What? Oh. Got it. Well, think it over. How are you holding up? I don't know. The whole thing shook me up something fierce, but I'm still here. I'm upset. Angry at Evan. Sad about him being, you know, scared Dead. folks won't believe me. I'm not much for math, so I couldn't tell you how that averages out. But thanks for asking. Well, that's everything I need to know. So, what happens now, Inspector? She needs to be reported, dude. She literally... It, it, was, it, was, a, it was an accident, okay? In our timeline, in our world, this would probably be more involuntary manslaughter. Uh, if... If it was downgraded, only because the intent to kill him wasn't there. You know what I mean? Uh, although there was an altercation, so you never know. It could be actual murder. The fact that she kept it uh, a secret and didn't tell nobody speaks of intent. So she could actually go down as, uh, as a murderer, to be honest. But in this world, I don't know. I just don't know. She might get fired, which we know what happens when you get fired from a corporation in this world. Uh, let me see. Yeah, see this? I, I, I feel bad for this, but 
either A, you killed him with intent, or B, it was an accident, but you left him to die. Either way, she has to pay for this, man. If you still think I killed Evan O'Connell, you've got cobwebs in your attic. Evan was a friend. I don't know what killed him, but it sure as shit weren't me. Now get out of my face. I'm on duty. She... She basically admitted it. Well, okay, well, to be fair, to be fair, she did say... The fall killed him. She never said that. She was the one that did the fall. That made him fall or whatever. But still, regardless, my hunch is pointing towards him. Alright, let's see what this says right here. So, pool where Hor dwe uh, dwelt. The Grand Colonial Pool has been shut down thanks to an outdoor, uh, uh, an adorous uh, contamination. Given the circumstances, something doesn't smell right. Literally. So, investigate the pool, investigate the sun parlor. So, the sun parlor is closer. I do want to check the pool first. But the sun parlor is closer, so we're definitely going to go and check that first. Just in case. None of these guys are named. Hotel guest. Hotel guest. So that's in here, right? Yeah, sun parlor. Got it. Ooh. Pool cleaner blue water coloring number 422 chlorinsol hydrogenated div Okay, well, not gonna bother trying to read that. Oh, it's gonna make me read. Okay, let's see. It seems Rizzo has set uh, me up with another straightforward task. Slug has an automatic mixer. Uh, mixer for the pool cleaner. If it's automatic, one would think it would uh, it wouldn't need to be manually cycled. But I suppose I should be thankful it works at all. Instructions: mix the uh, mix the chemicals by cycling. This just literally tells me the the thing. Like how it works, and what do I need? So like chemical uh, chemicals like chlorinsol. I don't even know what that is. Uh, muriatic acid, and a bunch of other stuff. So all right, whatever. I'm just gonna take the word of this area and guess on everything else because I really don't want to read, mainly because I'm not a good reader. But oh, the terminal. Speaking of reading. Greenhouse terminal. Select an option below. View VAT 1 status. Okay, so these are just the, the stuff that's getting mixed. Will be removed and chemicals confirmed. So those are the... Okay. I think we've made progress. Oh, wait a minute, I'm supposed to mix this. Huh. Huh. So something... Maybe I do have to read this. Instructions. Mix the chemicals by cy cycling each vat. Then use the console to create a compound. Once you have the desired combination, not exactly uh, not exactly building a terraformer here, but no matter how simple these things are, some people will still have problems. It doesn't actually say What would be the, what would be the, whoops, wrong button. What would be the right answer here? So the, uh, let's 
see what this says right here. Uh, I don't see anything. Huh, I don't know. I really don't know. Let's take a look around. I might have to play the guessing game, to be honest. Yeah, I don't see anything. So, I think... Oh, wait, actually, that's it right there. So, let me see. Blue Chloris. Okay, so the answer is number four. Number one, four, one, five. This doesn't even give me the option for four. Four, one, four. So that one's four. This one's got to be five. All right, let's try that. One, five, four. Yep, let's try that. Yep, um, I don't know. You have gained pool cleaner. Hey, I, I did it, right? So let me see, balcony, pool filter. Before I clean this though, I do wanna do a little bit more investigating because I really don't know what the ramifications are in terms of the investigation. Let's uh, let's actually go upstairs and do this balcony thing and see what this guy has to say. What's your name? Donovan Mantis. I saw you meander on out of the pool and into the greenhouse. Now you're here. Does that mean what I think it means? Uh. I read your note. Suffice it to say, I'm interesting. Uh, interested. Good. If you're interested in burying the pool, I'm interested in paying you. That seems seems a little evil for me. I mean, not in a grand scale, but still. So why go after the hotel pool? Not exactly the most high-profile uh, target. Yeah, it's. <laughs> I, I'm actually with this one and this. Seems kind of pointless. But let me see. Uh, yeah, not exactly a high-profile target. Eh, maybe not. Maybe I just want Rizzo's working relationship with Slug to implode for the benefit of Spacer's choice. But you're right. It ain't high-profile. And it ain't gotta be. Any damage to Rizzo's is cause for celebration. You ain't gotta concern yourself with my spite. Consider me an average Byzantine, and I'll consider you an average contractor. So, I got it. It's uh, corporate sabotage, essentially. Uh, yeah, I don't want to get caught up in inter-corporate politics. Shame. Well, I hope you'll soon see Rizzo's for what they are and help me bring them low. Maybe. We'll see. I don't know. Let's do some more investigating. Maybe so I'll find something that's going to change my mind. So, all three of these are for the pool. Yeah, pool filter. We're not gonna do the filter just yet. I do wanna. Can I? Can I walk in here? Timeline discrepancy detected nearby. Analysis reveals the chemical signature of this compound is 80% semblant of fertilizer used in the purpleberry orchards. The other 20% is semblant of pool water. Good to know. Pool filter. A mechanical contraption uh, for the for propagating chemicals inserted above through the pool water someone has scratched a sentence into the filters plant uh, plating iron was here or Arion? is this the same Arion from the groundbreaker that was uh, on Scylla if I mean it seems like something he would do to be honest 
Well, I haven't found anything that's gonna tell me otherwise, and this is just not right. It's a freaking hotel, dude. Alright. So, let's clean this and talk to the guard. Maybe he'll have something nice to say. Oh, thanks a million, Inspector. The smell cleared right up. Well, in a couple hours, the guest might even be back. Then I actually gotta start doing my job. Of course, we're not gonna get a follow-up shipment for the water anytime soon, so they'll have to content themselves on the deck. I got a little something for making my job that much less miserable. It's the key to our storeroom. If Ooh. my boss asks, you never met me. Yeah, happy to help. Storeroom key, where is the storeroom key? I wonder where the storeroom key or the storeroom is. I I legit don't know. Let's uh break this down. So these are both. So I think this is the one we were on. Track down the profit of prof, uh, profitability. Let's go to the orchards. That's. Probably where I want to go first. Okay, so it's way out there. 